CICM, Congregatio Immaculata Cordis Mariae, or the Congregation of the Immaculate Heart of Mary. This Belgian congregation of male missionaries came to Negros in the 1960s and built a seminary by the sea on land in Talisay City, donated by the Claparos family. For three decades, the seminary trained young men from all over the Philippines to preach the Word of God. But when the number of seminarians dwindled, the congregation concentrated its training of priests in its seminary in the mountain province, and the Talisay City Seminary was converted into a mission center in the early 2000s. It is now called Mary Shore to honor the congregation's Marian devotion and to evoke its location by the sea. The center offers a venue for spiritual activities for groups and individuals and derives its income from this service. This is a place where you can pray. We have retreats and recollections. We have seminars, team building. There are families who come here every now and then. They spend an hour or two walking up and down along the seawall. We are making our place available, especially for you priests. If you're tired, come and spend a night here. You know, have some silence. Ito, napakaganda. The Mission Center provides a peaceful setting for prayer and reflection, as well as safe and comfortable accommodations for its guests. Stimulating ocean breezes refresh body and soul, as do the sunset views from the gardens that are personally maintained by Father Olivares. I find the place beautiful, no? Pero there is some beauty here that they cannot also find somewhere else. Parang merong flavor ng spirituality, eh? Yung religious ba? You can just sit down just as you want, reflect, pray, Unfortunately, the coronavirus pandemic cut the mission center's activities short, but God opened a window. Although the center has a chapel on the third floor exclusively for the building's staff and guests, Father Butch decided to use their extensive seaside garden as a venue for Sunday masses, which they offered to the public as a community outreach. We started the community masses during the pandemic. Kasi limited ang makakasimba sa church. Ibang churches, may number ka pa. If we hold the mass dyan sa pavilion, the priest stays inside. Yung mga tao nasa labas na. Ideal for social distancing. They can place their chair anywhere they want. Mahangin. Safe. And although it began as a pandemic contingency, the community masses will probably become a regular feature in the new normal. I think it will be a regular feature of Mission Center. We cater to our neighbors after the community masses. May nag-sponsor ng snacks. So we serve arroz caldo no, to the people. Parang socialization na rin. We talk to one another. And thus, thanks to a twist of fate or act of God, the CICM Mission Center changed from cloister to community. I think we have been given a beautiful place. Why not share it with others? Come and visit Mary Shore. Come and pray here. I thank God every day for the beauty of the place. God is found in the silence. See the beauty and taste the silence of the center.